one, it's your boy, Mr. Locario, the bad boy of the dating game. What's good? So, um, going live real quick. What I wanted to say is that you guys need to make sure that you do not give women what they want. Okay, what am I talking about here? All right, you got a lot of, a lot of dudes, a lot of guys. I've been getting a lot of emails lately. A guy is talking about, y'all want a girlfriend. What up, Tay? What's good? I want a girlfriend. I want to make sure I got a girl and all this other shit. So what happens is, is that guys are starting to do things because they think that I got to do this because she wants this and she wants that. What up, Bernard? Andre was good. Logan was good. Um, so the thing is this. Don't give women what they want. As simple as that. What, 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 what am I talking about? You basically need to figure out what you're trying to do in your life, right? Now, as a result of you figuring out what you want to do and you doing what you want to do, then you get girls who are going to gravitate to who you are and what you're about and get with your program. It's that simple. So you don't have to give women what they want because what they want, what up, Mizan, what's going on? What they want is going to be what you are. You understand what I'm saying? What up, princess? So what you what what they want is going to be who you are and the type of guy you are. But you have to first be you. You see what I'm saying? So a lot of guys they fail in the game and they get shit fucked up because they are continuously trying to figure out what the girl wants and they're trying to give her the shit. You feel what I'm saying? Trav, what's good? What's going on? What's popping? So, yeah, so, you know, don't worry about giving her what she wants. You see what I'm saying? What up, Asa? What's going on? So, all you got to do is do you, and then the girls who are into who you are and what you're about are going to come at you. It's that simple. Your relationships are going to be way more beneficial to you. It's going to be more interesting, more fun. You're going to have a better time with the women that you choose to stick with. Because those women are sticking with you based off of who you are. You see what I'm saying? Because too much guys have been conditioned to, to, to think that they need to give women what they want. You see what I'm saying? See, what a woman wants, right, is not even in your business. It's her business. So she, it's her responsibility to find what she wants, right? So if she wants you, and she actually does want you, that means that who you are is what she wants. So you don't have to change anything. You don't have to do anything. You just got to be yourself. You see what I mean? We got up here. Jonathan, Robbers, James was good. So yeah, what you got to do is do your shit. You got too many motherfuckers out here, right? Who are bending over backwards for chicks. <laughs> Princess, you said notes need to be taken. <laughs> But yeah, that's the thing, man. It's real simple. Like this shit, you know, guys make it more complicated because they're so worried about getting a girl. You understand? And it shouldn't be about you trying to change yourself or doing a whole bunch of bullshit to get the girl. It's about you being you and getting girls who are going to follow your lead. It's, it's, it's real simple. Michelangelo, what's going on? So what's going out, on out there with you people? and shit you feel me and so you know it was funny too because earlier today i was on facebook and um you know I'm, I'm looking at some of these these women's uh posts you know some chicks on my friends list and everything and you know they're talking a whole bunch of craziness about like you know oh well you know a guy is supposed to do this for her and a guy is supposed to do that for her and he if he really likes her he's gonna do this and he's gonna do that that's bullshit. Sims do all of that shit. You understand? So a lot of women, you know, truth be told, a lot of women are not prepared to deal with a man. You understand what I'm saying? They're prepared to deal with like Sims and all of that shit, but they're not, you know, prepared to deal with real motherfuckers. You understand? Because in order for you to, you know, in order for women to be able to do that, they got to be on top of their game and most of them aren't which is why they are they want you to sort of 
bend to their whim. You see what I'm saying? See, let, let's 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 get some clear here. When two people are on top of their shit, when a man and a woman is on top of their shit, they're gonna get what they want. See, whatever a woman wants is her responsibility to get, and whatever you want is your responsibility to get. You feel what I'm saying? Bernard, you said they'd be looking for excuses. Because check this out. Let's say, let's say you were complaining about not getting girls. Right? Imagine you said to a whole bunch of women, let's say you was like, yo, the reason why I'm I don't have a girl is because y'all chicks is on some bullshit. And y'all chicks is this and y'all chicks is that. Now, now what they would say to you is. You ain't got no game, which is why you ain't getting these women. So the same thing applies for women. You understand? So when a woman is not getting what she wants, it's because she doesn't have any game. Her game is weak. So it's not up to you to change who you are to give her what she wants. You understand? It's not up to you to do that. It's up to her to figure out what she wants and find that. And if she figures out, if she figures out what she wants and what she wants is who you are, then that's when you and her are going to click. You understand? If it's not going to click, it's not going to click, and then she keep it moving. You understand? But don't ever feel like you're supposed to change who you are to impress some chick and all that. What up, my dude? Gonzo Fisher, what's good, homie? What's popping with you? Magno, Yemi, what's good? You said these girls stay complaining, you're not pandering to shit? You got Panner in her, Sean. Now, nah, real talk, but see, you got dudes out here that feel like they need to pander. They need to fucking, uh, you know, like, uh, go along to get along type shit. They on that happy wife, happy life nonsense. You see what I mean? Like, I'm tired, yo, I'm tired of so many of these dudes out here, you know, they're not, they're not making shit pop because they're scared to be who they are. And they're so concerned about making chicks happy. They're so concerned about not fucking offending some chick. They're so concerned about how they look in front of these girls is, is whack. You see what I'm saying? That shit is some bullshit. You got to just do you. You feel what I'm saying? Now, before you turn off this video, I want you to do three quick things. One, I want you to click the link below to send me a question. If you have a question on dating and relationships, I'll make a video about it. Two, I want you to click the link under that to get my free audio program, Undeniable Game, which teaches you seven easy to follow tips on how to really attract beautiful women. And three, I want you to click the link under that one to go to Bad Boy Membership, where you get 45 through 90 minute audio and video dating advice tutorials every month. Hey, what's up? It's dating and life coach, Mr. Locario. Go to Bad Boy Membership membership.com and master the dating game by joining my bad boy membership program in this program you'll receive 45 through 90 minute easy to follow step-by-step -step dating advice tutorials that's guaranteed to help you attract date and have sex with beautiful women join the bad boy membership today by going to badboymembership.com that's badboymembership.com